All right, all right, all right. Welcome to day number 12, guys, of the Legion Challenge. As you can see, all the ones highlighted in red, we've already done. And so um, we're almost halfway through this. Pretty, pretty excited about this. Um, so the last one we did, we did a painter, which was pretty awesome. Um, great episode on that one. If you're on LinkedIn or if you're on Facebook right now, if you want to replay, it will be on YouTube. So check it out whenever you can. If you have any questions, again, um, hit me up. You can DM me, email me, whatever works best for you. Just uh, reach out and um, I'll try to answer your questions as best and as fast as possible. So um, without further ado, let's go ahead and dive right into the next one. Let's get to it. Let's pick it up, shake it up, and see what's up. see today guys we have engine what I picked nine but I guess the one that I had before was actually nine but it was it's actually just six the last one that I picked up not a nine so we're gonna flip the script landscaper it is so just by the way there we go we're gonna do six a landscaper this should be a good one and as usual guys if you're a landscaper let's go ahead and go to the google and type in landscaper in dallas ah. not home landscape landscaper the capital R. I'm sure it's showing right now, but let's make sure it's clean. All right, so here we go. So you can easily rank for this three pack. And as I said in previous videos, guys, if you just look at this checklist, and then go through it. I will promise you you'll be ranking higher than what you were before because a lot of these people aren't doing half of these. Um, let's go, on, go back to the three pack. So this guy's ranking, he has like no reviews or anything. So go to more businesses. Well, he should be ranking higher than this. I mean, you have all these people that aren't getting reviews, but um, yeah, follow that checklist. I promise you, you'll be ranking up higher. But anyway, let's go back to this. So yeah, do all those as usual. Claim your business first, and then do you <clears throat> go over your review strategy of how you're actually getting reviews from your clients and customers. Add reviews and then add photos so people can actually see how your business is structured, how it looks, how clean it is, and then your web page. Of course, you want to state what you do above the fold. What the fold is, it's this right here. And anything that's below the fold, you want like more of what you do. Here's a business, what sets you apart from everyone else. And also, more importantly, this is vital. This is what people don't do, is actually have two separate call outs of your location and another separate call out of your service, <clears throat> your service pages. So like what you do, like hedges, bushes, like whatever that is, whatever you do, like keep them separate. Don't put it on one page. Location, same thing. Don't put all your locations. If you're servicing Garland, Frisco, Plano, keep those pages separate. Don't put them all on one page. And then of course you have the review page with proper schema. That just allows Google to know um, about your reviews page and it basically broadcast that on the internet. So. Um, that's all of that in a nutshell. Again, take note of that. Um, optimize it and you'll rank slowly. It won't be right away, but you'll get there. I promise you, you'll get higher than what you are before. So uh, let's go ahead and dive right into the Facebook ads. Let's go ahead and go to campaign. And we're going to, let's just target the housing community again. Check the box. If you don't check the box, your ads will not run. So make sure you do that. 
uh, we do Legion. So <clears throat> if you're new to this, Legion is for people that don't have a lead capture page or um, a landing page for the leads or like your website is not even like built to actually um, capture the leads itself. So this is perfect for that. All you need is a privacy policy and you'll see why here in a minute. But the conversion rate on this compared to your actual website is considerably higher and you'll see why here in a minute also. So Legion. It's gonna be of course land scaper. And guys we're gonna do of course the Facebook ads, and then we're gonna do the YouTube ads, and then we're also gonna do the stealth method. Wait to the very end to, to see what that is. But uh, on the YouTube I'm gonna show you how to create a video in under like five to 10 minutes without having any video skills whatsoever, and it's free. So, but stay tuned for that also. But anyway, moving right along, Landscape with Legion. And of course you're gonna select your page. And then people who live in this area, all this location, wherever you're at. Dallas, Tejas, <clears throat> and by selecting the category, you can't alter your age, you can't alter your gender, you can type in the language, and if you're bilingual, hey, put Spanish in there too, or whatever the language is, and detail targeting, so, Um, let's see if landscaping is in here. Landscaping. What lawn care? What lawn? First, I'm home buyer. Of course, if you're an apartment, you don't need that. You didn't start her home. That's good enough for a start. And then, of course, you're gonna wanna like test out different interests and see what works and what doesn't, but this will get you going and as usual, keep it there. As I said in previous videos, I've been getting more cheaper CPCs based on on this placement, so leave it as is instead of using the, the normal news feed. Ten dollars a day. It's a great way to start. Continue. And then if you have like you and your team actually <clears throat> like out in the field doing the thing then you want to use um like your own image and then showcase that that way of course like i said before um it's great for brand and it's great to get that connection between you and your clients as well to see how your team works and then change image stock photos Lagging. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. If there aren't any good photos in this, we'll just go to either Pixabay, Unsplash, or pixels to get the photo but hopefully they have something in here that way we don't have to worry about it ah here we go so let's choose this one No, 
I was just cooking and thinking. photo wasn't it anyway let's try another one So we're going to use, we'll try to use this one. Uh, this is called Advert Suite. As you can see, we're going to try to actually find any kind of landscaping ads that actually worked. This one did a really good 2600, so I read more. Huh. So they actually used some social proof by saying they're award winning uh, landscaping company, which is cool. What else we got? Again, guys, if you want to check this software out, which is pretty awesome. No, because I've had it for about three or four days now, and it's actually doing a lot better. I guess because my. I wasn't searching the right way, but um, looks like it's getting better and better as we're going through this. I'll leave a link down below so you guys can check it out if you're interested, or actually uh, see me a message or this, send a comment down below like, hey, um, add software. Yeah, just put add software in the comments and then um, I'll hit you back and then I'll give you the link that way. But, uh, but yeah, it's, it seems like it's pretty cool. But anyway, um, let's see. Wow, this one has 900, are you kidding me? We'll see what this one's about. Oh, it's just thumbtack. Ah, uh, that's the higher landscapers for thumbtack, never mind. Uh, let's see what about this one. Where did it go? This is so many ads. kind of cool to donating back so um, it looks like I mean just having generic photos of people in here is just really good enough and let's see what the target is with one of these so I'm just gonna pick one of these out this one so that's the landing page that they're sending people to let's see if we can actually click on that and opens up oh, it finally opened up right on all right so okay so great example this is a website this is not a landing page the difference is landing page has one objective, and that's for you to fill out a form, or you call the business. It doesn't have really any other links on that page, therefore you can't wander off and the conversions are higher. Looking at this, you can see I can click on services, I can click on about, so their Facebook, their LinkedIn, not to say that this won't work, but the conversion rate's gonna be a lot higher because you actually get them to do one thing. So, let's see. At least they have 
the services on different pages. Uh, that's good. Uh, but yeah, anyway, this is what they're doing. And so what we'll do is just stick to our same old script that we've been doing the past, I don't know, 10 campaigns. So copy this and then paste that at, let's see, Larry's lawn service. We have surfaced. DFW we have serviced residents in the DFW area for the past 20 years um, help for your own again guys just calling out um, like who they are or what they are and then asking uh, do they need help and this is why we can help proof that we can help and this is basically saying, um, this is how we can help you today. And you'll just give them, again, irresistible offer, whether that be, let's just call it 25% off. So whatever your offer is, you wanna obviously call that out right here. And of course you can have like a check mark down here too if you choose to and again having the emojis in there is gonna like basically bring more attention to everybody else's to your ad because it catches the viewers eye then you get offer scroll down inform questions you're gonna do contact field phone number but yeah, label it. Landscaping. Uh, see, form type, leave as is. Questions. Intro, you can keep it or leave it. It's up to you. You don't need to do that. We'll turn it off. Questions, yeah. Want to get their name, email, and phone number. And the reason why this is so important, guys, because it it automatically fills it out for them, so they don't have to think about it. That's why the conversions are so much higher as as opposed as opposed to going to a landing page, as we just saw. Um, it's already there. Conversion rates are going to be tremendously higher, especially when you take them to a uh, website that doesn't have a way to capture their information. So definitely use this method, privacy policy, if you have one. You're gonna just copy that link and then you're gonna paste that link right here. Thank you message, you're all set, blah, blah, blah sent to Larry's lawn service button type you're going to do call business call now and then your number down here wherever that might be and then you're done you're going to hit finish you're gonna hit confirm, 
Facebook's, <clears throat> Facebook's gonna review it in the next 24 to 48 hours, and then it's off and running, and then you're done, and that's it. Pretty simple, guys, easy peasy. But if you're looking to have just traffic drive to your website without having the landing page, all you do is change your, your campaign to traffic to this one or conversions. And then at the very end where it says, where you select the call to action, you select um, learn now, and then you just paste your website link into the open slot that they have for you, and then that's it. You hit confirm, you're off the races. All right, so that's Legion 1. Legion 2 is gonna be YouTube. And I'm gonna show you how to do this, how to create a YouTube video without any tech skills, without any video skills, and it's done like within five to 10 minutes, and it costs you zero money. So let's go ahead and get right to it. Let's go to AdWords. If you don't have Google AdWords, um, if you wanna test this out, go for it. Um, I will actually give you a link if you comment below or DM me, message me, I'll give you a link to actually get a discount off your first order of Google AdWords. So, um, yeah, hit me up whenever you're whenever you're ready to do this. So, but anyway, let's go ahead and dive right in. Campaigns, new campaign. You're gonna hit this one. Create a campaign without a goal guidance, and then you're gonna hit video. Leave as is, you can use these other options, but just for the sake of this video and um, just to keep it simple, keep it as is, hit continue. Then whatever your budget is, I'm just gonna say 100. You can start and stop just like you can with Facebook. And then you're gonna do English. Dallas. Topics. You can do keywords also, but let's see. Landscape design, gardening, garden maintenance. good enough you can just select all home and garden if you choose to but yeah that's good enough then any placements fine 50 cents per view and again guys either create your own video, like record your crew working, doing the thing, or you can just create a video using static images and uh, exporting them, and then export them as, as an MP4, then creating your own YouTube channel, uploading that video to your YouTube channel, then copying that URL and you're gonna throw it in here, and then it's gonna do the pre-roll of the ads on YouTube, so. Um, I'm going to show you that real quick. So yeah, all you gotta do is do PowerPoint and all you do is get like, I'd say four to five images of your crew working or your business. And you can do, you can say like whatever that picture is, describe it in some kind of caption on the photo. And then on the very last slide, all you're gonna do is Put in your call to action, list out your services, your phone number, and then all you're gonna do is file, save as movie, or file export as an MP4, depending on what version of PowerPoint that you have. I've seen them both ways, but, uh, and that's it. Like, you're done like within five to 10 minutes by just using this method, and it's, it's effective too, just the same way. It doesn't look fancy, but hey, it works still. So um, I hope that helps on that one. And then um, the stealth method. So if you're not confused with the stealth method is, I will show you right here. 
and this method is going to allow you to get in people's inboxes without having them to opt in the actual um, lead form. So, campaigns, click on the button, new campaign, same <clears throat> objective, create a campaign without a goals guidance, click on that, click on display, click on Gmail campaign. And then don't worry about that and hit continue. Locations, wherever you're at. English, budget, $10 a day, just like Facebook or whatever your budget happens to be. Cost per click. It's going to be let's do 50 cents. And then you're gonna create an ad, a Gmail ad, and let's call it yeah, Larry's. Headline. Let's see if I can go back and uh, let's see. Let's try and grab this. description headline will be whatever this is copy paste final URL that'll just be your URL to your website or your landing page I don't know why it does this but anyway you get the picture <laughs> Uh, let's go back. So yeah, put your URL to your landing page or your website. Images, you're gonna use two. You could use video if you want to, but um, you could use a video that you just did for YouTube if you chose to. <clears throat> um, I'd rather just do images. I've seen it work either way, but um, yeah, so images, you can do a logo, or you can do a marketing image. Logo is gonna go on the left of this, marketing image is gonna appear right here. So I have some dummy artwork that we can use. So let's see, let's go ahead and choose this as a logo. Logo, continue, and then you're gonna use a marketing image so you can just go to Pixabay like I did earlier in previous videos let's see it's probably gonna be anything here see this it's the same dude but just for presentation purposes, let's go ahead and snag this. Let's go ahead and throw them in there. Mark the image, select, center it wherever you want. Continue, save, then boom. <clears throat> and then you can click on both the phone or the computer version just so you can see which one you like the best or which one um, you think needs a tweak or not. Uh, then yeah, that's how it's gonna appear in your Gmail account. As I said before, you can go there like literally like right now look at the top two lines you'll see where it says add and that's how yours is going to appear in there as well but um but yeah it's, like i said highly effective i've gotten a 30 to to 50 percent click through rate on it it's pretty cool um but yeah but that's basically in a nutshell if you want to change this call out too i don't think i showed it in other videos but 
call to action like that. And then you're just gonna type in like call now. And you can have like your number in here as well in this copy if you chose to. But uh, but yeah, that's it. Then you just hit create campaign and then you're done. You're off to the, the races and your ad's going. And if you made this part of the video, give me a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and the notification bell, and I'll see you next episode. Peace.